Next at 11, the Manatee County Administration Building is back open after a series of COVID-19 cases in its workforce. Two people died and three others were hospitalized. All of those infected worked in the very same department. ABC Action News reporter Haley Bull is learning the steps the county is now taking. Crews deep cleaned this building over the weekend. Now it's open with face masks optional here, but prevention measures encouraged for those not vaccinated. I know a lot of a lot of county staff who work in this building who worked in who work in our IT department are hurting. A grieving work family after COVID-19 struck the Manatee County IT department. County officials say resulting in two deaths and three other hospitalizations. This is a serious loss to our work family and um, a lot of people upset. Now, after a weekend of cleaning, the building is back open with face masks optional inside. County leaders say the cases impacted only those not vaccinated. You cannot mandate someone to be va to be vaccinated and you can't prevent them from entering a public space like our building. So uh, the, the uh, there is a, a, it was a strong recommendation to wear the mask indoors and to pr practice those uh, CDC approved guidelines if you're not vaccinated. Separately, a Port Manatee spokesperson also confirmed three cases in its security department the past three weeks among employees who, to their knowledge, were not vaccinated. Meanwhile, the effort to get more shots in arms here continues. Tonight, the Department of Health in Manatee County is asking people to consider getting a shot as soon as possible if they haven't already. The best big message is COVID-19 is not over. It is still here and it is still a serious threat to public health. Get vaccinated, get tested, practice, the prevention measures. We turn to USF's Michael Tang to ask about vaccination rates. Tampa is higher than the statewide in general, but I think it, it almost looks like a gradient to me. He says some people still need more info, though. And so you have pockets of unvaccinated people, they, you'll, you'll find these pockets of transmission. Now, as far as whether variants are behind the cases here, the Department of Health in Manatee County doesn't want to speculate until it hears back from the lab. Reporting in Bradenton, Haley Bull, ABC Action News.